Welcome to week five of our Spring Mystery Quilt Along. Grab your strip pieced panel from week three. Cut it into 12 one and a quarter inch wide sections. Be very careful and cut these sections slowly so that they are precise. Twelve sections, one and a quarter inches wide. Pin your twelve pieces onto a spot labeled week number five on your foam core board. Okay, on to part two. Grab the two and a half inch squares from your main print. And grab the half square triangle units from week number four. We're going to sew together a unit with three of our squares. A half square triangle unit, a main square, and another half square triangle unit. Make sure your half square triangle units are placed exactly as shown. I'm going to lay out all 16 of my units and then bring them over to the sewing machine like this so that I keep everything nice and organized. Using a scant quarter inch seam, sew your three squares together to form a two and a half inch by six and a half inch unit. Continue to make all 16 sections. Press your seam allowances as directed on your pattern. When I'm pressing, I like to set my seams first. And then press the seams in the direction as indicated on the pattern. And don't forget a nice little spritz of best press so that your seams and your blocks lay nice and flat. Label another spot week five on your foam core board and place all 16 two and a half by six and a half inch rectangles on that spot. And that's all for week number five's homework. If you have any questions or comments about this week's homework, please add them to the comment section below. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to our channel to enjoy more videos and quilt alongs.